Couple of chains, couple of watches Moved up from the top five, a couple of notches uh, Couple of L's, couple of oxes Put a couple of your loved ones up in them boxes Whole front row in black dresses and mock necks After that, they gon' throw a party and pop X Put it out, let the streets talk, no promo A real man shouldn't have to say no homo The f***ing champ is back You could bring it to the lab, it's so dope that it can't be cracked Thank you, Surreal Mookie, la, la. Alright, real Mookie, I've been looking at your videos, pretty dope. I ain't gonna hold you. I ain't gonna hold you the way you break this shit down. Shout out to Surreal Mookie, man. I watch the blogs. <laughs> so, like, shout out to Surreal Mookie. He's a, he's a blogger. Shout out to him. You know what I'm saying? Who's built to survive? In my Beasley voice. <laughs> <laughs> and watch how fast it go from a smack to chrome. This was an easy choice. Oh. What's good, y'all? It's Surreal keeping it real, giving this battle rap, media, news, and comedy. Hit that like, share, and subscribe. I'm just here to break down the first round from John John and Easy so people can get a better understanding on why they would have John John or Easy winning. You know what I'm saying? But hit that subscribe button and like. Let's get right to it. So, Easy. Had to go first. He starts out with some bars, but he basically had a lot of drug bars. He came out and said, let him be or let him get the, you know, pretty much knockout. Leave him alone. All these people got principles. Then they fold. It's a two-step verification with the wrong number because you can't check their code. All right. That's fire. I mean... It's, it's kind of, you know, direct to, to a lot of people. Now, he also had another drug bar. It was a football sack. So, pretty much, he had um, a fish scale. He turned, he basically put it into water and turned it into sparkling water. Another drug bar. He also had something where niggas he had piled up in the car. It was like a cheesecake factory bar shooting them with a cheesecake. Uh, they don't want to get out the whip, or should I say the car. He also had a Jamaican where he picked up from the Jamaicans and sold to the Haitians. And pretty much he had the H and had a receipt. Another drug bar. It wasn't direct. Direct straight to uh, John John. You know what I'm saying? Which They're all fire drug bars, but they're not direct. Let's keep going. How can a nigga that does, doesn't go through what he goes through speak to him? Basically, he's window shopping, so he had to go into his window. I, I get it to a certain degree. I get it. All right. He also said he traded rocks for a Nintendo Switch. How many people dealt, you know what I'm saying, drugs and got electronics for it? It's not new, but that was fire. Uh, he also said John John battled t-top eight years ago and basically he was on a show called spit that eat and he was just known to get people into url he wasn't hot like that so the only energy that people got from hip um john john and don was basically he was able to get people in url he was just a connect that's it um he's saying basically right now as we're speaking all his life he, he lived around his enemies all right we're gonna Leave it right there. Nah, let's go to the, the next part. Then he came out and said he got a bunch of gun attachments. Let the gun attachments basically can kill John John and let the true crime TV show reenact it. That was fire. He also came out and said he had two back-to-back -back joints, or should I say events, but nobody really wanted to see John John battle Mr. Fab. He also said when ball pin was falling on the ropes, basically Easy reached his hand out, so basically John John can tag team or tag him in. You know what I'm saying? It was a WWF bar. We had the event now. You know what I'm saying? Cause two events didn't go good. That was fire. Uh, he had everything from 19 to 22. It was like a college dorm. That was fire. People reacted off of it. Definitely fire. And of course, he said, you know, before the Bel Air and all this other stuff and acting, in front of the judge, he did a monologue. 
that's how he ended his first round. Now, he had a lot of drug bars. Um, a very little bars towards his opponent. Now, John John, I'm going to break his down now. So, John John starts out and says that recording thing, B, not G. So, the audio he dropped today on Instagram wasn't a G thing. It wasn't a street thing. But, he going to be called an op and he's with it. That's basically what he's saying. Alright, then he turned, he turned a patty chatty to a top cheese. Alright. He also came out and said he, he basically had a Dr. Dre interscope scheme. You know what I'm saying? Where he pretty much set up easy in the scope off the audio. Uh, he also said, you are down 0-2 to two to me, but I had other plans. So basically, I guess the event, he's already, you know, 0-2. That basically John John and his team was winning, maybe. Or he might be talking about the rounds. I'm going to leave it like that. He also said... Leave money for your seed and send you up to where Reed is at. Basically the heaven because obviously easy destroyed Reed. So send him up there. He also kept yelling there's an elephant in the room. We searched the internet for the evidence. Fucking with someone's wife is definitely life and death. Um, okay, you guys already know he's talking about the Pat Poo situation. Hanging on rim, like a basketball rim, but rim. Too long, deserves a check. So basically, a witness, basically somebody in all black, jumped into the event and papped his jaw. Um, also, he fumbled, kind of like, you know, trying to see if he can get somebody to stand him up. Instead of that, it wasn't easy for easy to block, basically. That's how, that's how basically the bar is basically put together. Um, so, of course, he's still speaking about the Remy and Pap situation. He also comes out and says he would put a bullet on the algorithm and shut down the whole server. Uh, let's see what's going on. It's still being direct to easy. Yes, it's Pap Poos uh, and Remy bars, but... You know, that's still fresh and new, so of course they're going to choose that route. Let's be real. How many people battle Tay Rock and still bring up the tranny bar and all this stuff? So, that's the only thing that sucks about battle rap. Once somebody got an angle or something that really happened to you, they find ways to, you know what I'm saying, mix it up, remix it, whatever. And it's always going to be used. This is what? Easy's third battle? Yeah, it's going to still be used. He also said, I don't know where you're from, but he brought every germ in town, okay? So everybody knows that Easy ain't really from Philly, Philly, the heart of it, but he still reps it. He also says, he, he basically uh, does like a bar like Easy, how easy it is to break down basically a drug bar. So he adds a bar with Loso and um, Bad News. It was a drug bar. It was alright. It was fire. Um, there's gonna be a lot more friendly people where he sends easy to heaven. Um, he also says, "You big-headed niggas be harder to kill." So when I pass a bull's eye, the talk basically the target would be hit. You know what I'm saying? Um, so you know his, his you know. His league is called Bullpen, and of course, Easy be calling people the bowl, so you pretty much put it together like that. The first, he said, Bullpen over bullshit, and he said bullshit three times uh, to Easy's face. Then he came out and said, and his bullets was real. Basically, John John's bullets are real, but all of Easy's rounds are fake. Uh, he also said for every action is a reaction Y'all understand what he means on that He also said Who's built to survive in my Beasley voice Which I played that in the beginning Watch how fast it goes from a smack to a chrome Easy choice That was crazy That was I mean honestly That was crazy 
um, he definitely got a reaction for it. But then again, Philly is Philly. You know, they, they rep for their people. Uh, also, he says, you want to fight these bars. Death must be easy because life is hard. And then he came out and said, I won't mention Geechee. You just don't mention Sue Surf. And he ended it with a mook bar saying easy. But this is easy. Easy. Now, out of hearing the first round from both of them, who was more direct? Let's start there. As a battle rap fan, some people can like the drug bars and feel like it's fire. But when you're in a battle rap, Let's be honest. You, it's about you attacking your opponent. I'm just being as fair as I can. I wanted to break this down. I am not biased. I'm just breaking it down because somebody biased will break it down and automatically choose certain people. So let's just be real with it. Who was more direct? Y'all let me know in the comments. This is the first round breakdown. This is surreal. Keeping it real. Keep your eyes out and you better rest read because something's always bound to go down. But I'm out. And before I go, I'm just going to say John John was more direct with his bars and more personal than easy. I would break down the second and third, but out of respect, you know what I'm saying, these guys still got to get their sales because this is their event, you know what I'm saying, so they got to make their money back. But before I go, based into the second and third round, I pretty much take points away when a battle rapper is looking at their phone during the rounds you should remember your rounds i said it about you know what i'm saying arsenal when he did it to miss hustle i just feel like a battle rapper shouldn't look at their phone at all in between rounds or nothing so y'all let me know man if y'all judging this judge it for everything it was a fire back and forth uh, if y'all have easy winning I'm not arguing. And same thing with John John. I'm not going to argue. They both did their thing. But I'm out, man. Hit that like, share, and subscribe. One.